Jesus hotline. What up, gamers? <laughs> the world won't let me do that. $75, I believe. Can't get this tongue out. I get my tongue out. And I can feel them pushing air. I burned the milk. To guide you through life. Gravity. Jesus hotline. However, through the power of God, can transform the porn addict. Restore a marriage. Hey guys, the truth to the power of God can restore a porn addict. That's what it said. Yeah. To hear an explanation of God's plan of salvation, press eight or hold to leave a voice message after the tone. I want it of me. I want it of the paper. You're already recording. Yeah. Oh, all right. It's too late. I am surprised that you kept all your papers. You can do this out in the street. Why? It's good enough. Mm -hmm. I've done it. There's ink on those. Do you? Is this recording? Yup. So how do you plan to get that out, Adam? Are you just going on YouTube? Maybe. If, if, I plug, if I plug my Instagram, will you keep it in? <laughs> no. What up, gamers? <laughs> it's your boy, Logan Rail. <laughs> Follow me at, at Railroad, R O E H L R D. See you later, Jake Ballers. Three, two, one. Oh my god, you guys were delayed. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be fine. Oh, ooh. <laughs> I went, ooh, it's not stupid. That's me and all of this rainbow. Oh my god, that's dang. Yeah, it says you're not I'm really so supposed to breathe it. I got that. It's not breathing. It's not breathing. <laughs> <laughs> it's not breathing. <laughs> it's not breathing. <laughs> it's not breathing. Oh, look at the bottom. It's a 24 hour. Oh. So today has been interesting. Uh, today was Thursday, and I didn't make a video today. Uh, one, because the Indecentage is doing that thing with Premiere where it just won't freaking re-export so I can edit it. So I don't know what to do. I really don't. I don't know what to do. I wanted to make an Indecentage, not a Minecraft video this week, but I don't think that's going to happen, unfortunately. The Indecentages may just have to be whatever I stream, which really sucks because I'd want the Indecentages to be their own content and not something people have seen before, but the world won't let me do that. Yes, so besides that, I didn't make a video the day before, but, you know, everything was great, but I, <sighs> I, just didn't make, I just didn't make a video. It really sucks because I, I want to make videos every day, but it's so hard, and I'm, I was really busy this week because um, this week is the week before everyone's school starts, so Christian, um, one of my best friends, I've known him for almost my entire life, now is moving away to go to a different college, or to, a, to go to a college that's not nearby. And um, so this is his last week, and so I've been hanging out with him a lot, playing games and stuff. So I feel like that's a valid excuse, but I shouldn't need to make excuses. I should just be making the content, but I'm not. Um, but today, we, for 12 hours, uh, built his Hogwarts Lego set. Um, a while back, he bought a Hogwarts Lego set and hadn't built it. Um, and him and me and my girlfriend Autumn, we built it um, the entire day for 12 hours. It was super fun and crazy, and uh, I just didn't get to make a video. I had set, I had time set aside to make the Indecentage, but it just wouldn't export. Um, I want to finish the uh, hammer shot this weekend, but at this rate, who knows? I'm really upset with myself for not making the videos that need to be made. And I wish that there was something mentally I could do to fix it. But there's really not. It really sucks. 
you know, I'm tired of making excuses on this channel for not making the videos that I should be making. Um, because consistency is key on YouTube. And, you know, I've been pretty consistent overall. Um, I've made at least a video on each channel a week, which is better than some channels do when they have millions of subscribers. But the past, like, two weeks have been really hard to make videos. Like, for me mentally, it's been really, like, tough to force myself to do it because of the editing process. If I'm not in the mood, it's really hard to be creative and be funny and all that. Um, and I, I poured a lot of that into my Apex Legends Iron Crown event video that went on the Indecence channel. I really lost it for the rest of this week. I was so ready to make an Indecent Touch tonight. I was in such a good mood. You know, everyone was over here. We were having a fun time. And um, I was ready to edit and, like, make some baller content, make something really funny. Because I've been having a good night. But I Premiere just refused. And I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. So, uh, it's Saturday, I don't know why I looked at my watch for that, and we have a package with the name on the back, so you can't see it, but it is from uh, Umbury, which uh, they make the haptic coin, which is one of my favorite fidgets that's ever been made, I shouldn't wave this knife around, uh, one of my favorite fidget toys that's ever been made. This is the new mini haptic coin, I ordered it the other day, and it was $75 I believe, so not cheap cheap. It is made out of titanium. Um, the old haptic coins are made out of aluminum, so this is a bit different. Oh man, I'm covering goo! Beauty guru. So it comes in this like weird plastic with a brown baggie. Oh, that's pretty small. So in this little brown baggie is my new haptic coin, which is actually the size of a coin. And ready? Focus. There it is. The new haptic coin. Literally the size of a coin. Huh. Anyway. <laughs> uh, that's the new haptic coin. Titanium. Blasted. Let me tell you. I've had these speakers. These old Dell speakers. For a long time. This subwoofer has done me well. These speakers are probably 10 to 12 years old, 2007, 2009, something like that. Um, we've had them for a long time. I've had them on my setup for a long time. Back when that was my computer desk, which was a while ago, um, that's the speakers I had. They came with an old Dell computer we had. And uh, they finally died. They started making some awful static noises and then the volume would just go up and down by themselves. So, broken. Um, I ordered some new speakers. I'm gonna go pick them up today. But uh, I have to kind of like deconstruct my desk. Because, you know, everything's hardcore wired up because I like to cable manage my stuff. Some bread for some reason back there. So it's like a whole mess under my desk and behind my desk right now because I had to undo all this. But hey man, I'm excited for the new subwoofer and new speakers that I am going to go pick up Best Buy. So we'll see how that goes. Hi, welcome to the amazing light segment of the show. These are the speakers I got. They're Logitech. Z623s, 400 watt speakers, easy controls. It's got a volume based thing on the actual speaker itself. It's THX certified, so it should be bassy as balls. I'm hoping they're good. They have great reviews, like a four, 4.5 on Best Buy. I don't know which side really matter. Um, they have good reviews, so I'm like, might as well. I had some really the speakers I had, while old Dell speakers, were actually really good. Apparently they were quite high-end when we got them. So I went with uh, these, which are high-end, I guess. 400 watt, 115 bucks, they're on sale, or five bucks off. What an amazing deal. Ow! And if you're wondering why I'm not wearing socks, I stepped in a puddle. It was really unfortunate. I can't get this tongue out. I can get my tongue out, but not, not the one for this box. Dear God, it's so tight. Alright, let's try the other one. Oh, maybe I should use this one. 
the one that has the hole for you to grab. So I guess it does matter which one. Yeah, that's that was dumb. That was dumb of me. Here we go. Oh, I didn't cut the other ones on this side. Right speaker, left speaker, power, aux, all that jazz. Oh, it's right there. Not that you'll be able to see it. Something like that. So here's our uh, right speaker. Bigger than I thought it would be. So that's not great. Left speaker. This is our aux cable. Good. And this is our power cable. And there's the sub. Holy garbo. Stand up for this one. Yeah. Come on. Oh, I ripped. I didn't realize the sub was this big. I have made a mistake. I thought the sub would be like so much smaller. Oh no. This is ridiculous. It's so tight in there. Jesus. All right, this might not be able to go. <laughs> This might not fit on my desk. For size reference, this is my old one. So, that's unfortunate. Um, needless to say, this should sound pretty good. I'm, see my thing is, sometimes the basement, if it rains a lot, will flood. Um, and I say flood, I mean we'll get like an inch of water and it'll just be in the carpet and stuff. I don't want this to be on the carpet, because it's what, made of wood? Hopefully there's room on my desk. I guess I'll just, um, I'll show you what it's like when I'm done. Okay, first of all, that's about half volume and I can feel them pushing air from the speaker, which is awesome. I played it at full blast earlier. Nuts, N absolutely nuts. I don't have the bass all the way up because I don't wanna like vibrate my table to death, but, um, and because I think it sounds bad, but I'm in like a balanced spot right now and it sounds so my old ones, my old speakers, they can they can go to the trash because these sound great. The subwoofer is ginormous though. Like, oh my god, this is huge. Uh, here's a moon ball for comparison. Yeah. yeah. Knocked over my kunai. It's big. It's a big boy. But it's uh, I love it. It was a good good amount of money spent, and uh, I'm I'm. I'm happy with it. Plus the power button is like so satisfying. It's Monday night and I uh, finished streaming a little bit ago. I went to make some uh, mac and cheese. I burned the milk. So after you know you boil the mac and cheese, you drain the mac and cheese, then you put in the butter, you put in your cheese packet and you put in your milk. Generally in like that order, Put my milk in first. Pan was still uh still hot. I didn't notice it until I took a bite. It tastes a little weird. I was like, did I put margarine in here on accident? Oh, I'm buys margarine. No. No. And then I realized I'm like, I put the milk in first. Probably wasn't a good idea. I burned the milk. I have burnt milk mac and cheese. I'm eating like bitter, like old mac and cheese. Damn it. Okay, here we go. It's that time of the week. This week sucked. This week was really bad. Um, I don't know what happened to me, but I, I really screwed up. I had nine and a half hours of work, which is nothing. Five hours and 75 minutes. I basically did like an hour of work a day, which is awful. Um, my sleep schedule has been really bad. I think that's my main problem, but besides that, yeah, let's break it down. Monday, I did nothing. Tuesday, I edited for an hour and a half, uploaded for 20 minutes, hour and 50 minutes total. Wednesday, I edited for two hours, did two hours and 40 minutes of work. For the rest, it was, you know, the video. Didn't do anything on Thursday, Friday. I didn't edit or anything, but I streamed on Twitch for five hours and five minutes to try to make up for that lack of content. Saturday, did nothing. Sunday, did nothing. Week total, nine hours, 35 minutes. It's quite simple. Um, I just suck. I really do. So I don't want to jinx it this week. 
I want to say I'm going to do better because I, I hope I will. I've already started out strong with Twitch. I have to edit the rest of this tonight. I think I've just been procrastinating so much that I don't do it. And then I just don't do it at all. So I'm going to try to kick myself and we'll see what happens. Focus! Did I transfer the... I can transfer the focus area. That's odd. Just focus on my face, please. I look forward to more content this week because it's actually going to happen. Uh, and... I'll see you later. Check out gaming channel in the description. Take care.